Hey, what's up guys? Today we're going to be doing a water change from a pit beta, Brady. And as you can see right here, we have him acclimating with his marimal moss balls. And right now what we're waiting is for him to acclimate to the water. Alright, but before that we're going to do some simple steps and some of the things that you might need to do a water change. Alright, so first thing, you're going to need some of these items. Beta water conditioner, tap water dechlorinator, aquarium salt, some filter charges. Actually, these are really cool because it comes in a six pack and every month I put it in a new filter. Um, and basically, this is what we're going to be doing. We're going to be adding, it says, a tablespoon for every five US gallons. So it's right there, five US gallons, one rounded tablespoon. We're going to add that. Just sprinkle it. Fuck. <laughs> Just sprinkle it all over and in there. I was actually surprised that betas need salt in their water. And then we're going to add this much of, oh, look at that salt. Mm. We're going to add this much of beta water conditioner. And I already added the dechlorinator. So basically, as you can see, look at all that is all those things that we're putting in the water. It is um, reacting and it is changing it up. As you can see, everything's working. The salt, the dechlorinators, the water conditioner. And basically what I'll do is I'll leave this for around 15 minutes with the filter on sometimes, but I let, I let it um, sit for a while. But in about five, ten minutes, I'm going to turn on the filter, let the water stay in there for at least 15 minutes before you expose your beta fish into it, just to be sure. And then right before you do that, you might want to test the, get some test strips. You know, these are great. You know, they come like with a lot of them. Test your water. You know, um, basically, yep, this is it. This is the the new this is the water change and I also every time that you do a water change it's really cool to switch up your arrangements and you know switch up the home for your pet beta fish because they do get bored and they like exploring so every time you switch up their environment they're exploring for you know who knows how long but they will explore the new environment, try to find a spot that they like, and you know, it just keeps them busy. And from the last water change, he was making bubbles nests, and oh, it's a little crammed in there. <laughs> but yeah, those are bubbles nests from the other water. He loves making bubbles nests. Hopefully, he continues to make bubbles nests in this new home. So basically, I'm gonna turn on the filter, because I'm impatient. Oh. Uh -huh. Alright, there we go. Turned on the filter. And as you can see, we're going to wait for the fish to acclimate to the temperature of the water. And we're going to let all these products do their thing and clean the water right before. So he will be going into the water in around, what, 10 minutes or so. So in 10 minutes or so, I will release him back into his aquarium 